Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to put Ultimate PSP Tube version 1.9 on your PSP. So first thing you want to do is turn on your PSP. Yes, this is the Ed Hardy theme. Since everybody always asks that in all videos, go down to USB connection. All right. Get that. Okay. As always, I will put a link to this website. Um, so click on the link, scroll down. Don't hit this. That's not what you want. You want this little orange right here. <clears throat> so once this site comes up, then you're going to get this thing that pops. So right click it and hit download file. Okay. Now, once you do that, you'll get that file right here okay so use WinRare WinRare whatever however you want to pronounce it and extract files at which point you will get these two right here now this optional theme you don't need to do that that's up to you what you really need is just this file right here so go on the root of your PSP go to PSP game folder and just take it from your desktop and you can drag it on here which I have already done now to use the optional theme all you gotta do is just click here and here's your eboot.pbp you can go here right click copy or you could just click and drag and it just replaces it you don't need to do that it just gives it a different theme okay so now it is on your PSP so remember just go from the root of your PSP into the PSP folder into the game folder and that's where it goes that's that's the folder right there right from your desktop okay so now that it's on your PSP Get out of USB mode. Go over down to game. And there it is. Ultimate PSP. Now this, it, your screen will look different if you do not put that, um, that optional theme on there. I just put it on there. So I'm going to connect it. Give me two seconds so I can load up on the internet and I'll show you guys how it works because a lot of people they don't tell you how, to, how it actually works and some of the buttons get confusing and I was getting frustrated so I figured I'd let you guys know how to do it so once it starts it's going to ask you to find your internet connection and you're on now I want to warn you guys that if you're doing this on your kids PSP or you're doing this on a minors um, this ultimate PSP tube does have adult sites so you can look up pornography which obviously I don't endorse or suggest for little ones okay now on the top see if I could zoom in on that probably not Okay, well anyways, right up here, you can't see it, I don't know why it's not showing up, um, you, to skip around, press select, and that will go to the different various things. I have mine set, it says YouTube on top. Now, in order to search, press and hold circle. Now, this is what you get on, okay. Um, we're just going to cancel that because I'll show you what not to do. Um, 
this thing will pop up where, it's, where it'll say site, open URL, net status, add to playlist, playlist. Um, most people, you would think you open up your URL and then type in what you want. No, that's not how you do it. So just press and hold circle and we'll just do PSP. Okay, so now it says PSP right there. Now all you do is take your finger and press start. If you see the green light flashing, then that means it's actually looking it up. And see, there you go. Here's videos. And um, to get the video to play, all you gotta do is... Now this didn't work for me earlier, but I swear to God guys, this does work. In order to get the video to play, highlight whichever one you want and press X. Um, like I said, this should be flashing. That means it's actually loading. Um, if it is going to work, see this one. Whoa! This one's not going to work because it'll right over here. This will say that's obviously it didn't start playing. This, if that gets off all the zeros and it says an actual number to how long the video is, then you know you got it to work. <clears throat> Let me try one really quick. Um, oh, just some functions really quick. Um, square will make the video go in different sizes. Like I said, triangle will give you that menu. X is supposed to be what you use to play the video. And circle is just for searching the video. Um, sorry I didn't get to... Uh... Oh, okay. And the R button will go to different videos. Uh, if you press select, it will redo everything. Um, so say you selected YouTube on top and you press select and go to a different site, well, it'll, whatever site you go on, like here, I'll do it really quick. There. Well, you can sort, yeah, there it is. Okay, see how it says YouTube and then it'll say what you searched. Now, okay, no videos found. I don't want any pornography ones popping up. Um, but anyways, now it's on crunch roll. It, it has a bunch of different things. Like I said, sorry, it's not working at the moment. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but I, to me, this, this program is, has its problems here and there. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So, sorry guys, I couldn't get it to work. Oh, there we go. If it doesn't work, just let it, let it sit. And uh, hopefully it'll work out. Uh, anyways, this should work on any custom firmware. So if you have any questions, problems, um, leave me a private message or can ask me a question on the actual video. So thanks for watching, guys.